to ask if I thought I was going to have a stroke, I would tell you definitely not. But I ate healthy and I worked out every day. It's generally good health. Homicide detective David Denmark experienced sudden stroke symptoms while at a restaurant. I could not move. I could not open my eyes because of the vertigo. And then it went downhill fast, real fast. David was transported to Baptist Hospital, where he was treated by the expert team at Baptist's Comprehensive Stroke Center. We obtained a CT of the brain. Uh, we assess the patient neurologically and to come up with a score uh, that tells us how severe the neurological deficit is. I keep hearing, you know, okay, he's in the window for the medication. TPA is a clot buster. Uh, so it's a medicine that we can give either through the vein or through the artery uh, that actually uh, breaks up the clot wherever it may be. If that uh, patient presents within three hours, we consider them a good candidate uh, for this type of treatment. After the administration of that uh, TPA, he says, uh, move your left arm. And when I raise my left arm up, he goes, you see it in his face, and he goes, move your left leg, and I lift my leg up. Everybody started clapping. Everybody was high-fiving each other, and just, I, that's when I was like, I might be okay here, you know what I mean? These guys are having that much, you know, of celebration, I might be good here. David responded remarkably well. Within 24 hours, all of his neurological symptoms had resolved. The clot was uh, in a place that usually um, causes more severe strokes. If he hadn't come to our comprehensive stroke center, uh, there likely would have been some type of neurological deficit permanent, and uh, he would have had a negative effect on his quality of life. Every day I wake up and I can move, and freely, I constantly think what it could have been like. My passion is, my job and also I play in a rock and roll band. I know how lucky I am. I owe everything to Baptist. <laughs>